It's Luis Sandoval here with Bob Aram. First of all, Bob, you got a lot of young guys up there. A lot of these guys seem like they're going to the next level, world championship. Is that how this card is, how you're looking at it? These guys are trying to graduate to, to real contenders out there and champions? Absolutely. Because, you know, Timothy Bradley and Manny Pacquiao are not young chickens. Their time in boxing is limited. And so you have to build future superstars uh, to maintain the interest in the sport. And these three guys have the opportunity to be the superstars of the future. Was it uh, difficult to get Abraham to come back to the States? I know he likes fighting overseas for this fight. Was it a uh, easy or hard negotiation to bring him here for, for Gilberto Ramirez? I made him an offer he couldn't refuse. How do you feel about that fight, Bob? It, it, you've often told me you wanted to fight Triple G, you wanted to fight the big names. Is, is, is he overdue for a big fight like this? Well, you know, Ramirez can't fight even bigger names without fighting and beating a big name like Arthur Abraham. He's been champion for a number of years. He's a well-known fighter. Uh, for Ramirez to get into the charm circle of very big fights, he's got to win the championship from Abraham. Bob, another thing, you know, Brandon Reels had retired after his fight with Bradley, and he said he's going to continue on to his career, and he's going to do it without Robert. Um, first off, were you surprised that, that he had a change of heart after announcing his retirement? I've been in this business 50 years. I mean, when a fighter says he's retired, you bet the money on the over that he'll be back <laughs> within six months. Is there a plan yet for Brandon? I know he said that he's willing to move up the ranks again and take a different approach. Uh, have you guys discussed what kind of route you're going to take for him on his comeback trail? No, he's, he should contact us and come in to see us or his manager. Yeah, we'd like to get Brandon back in action. But it's going to be up to Brandon. Are you surprised him and Robert? You, you've seen this a lot, Bob. You, even with Bradley and, and Joel, and now Brandon and Robert, where longtime trainer fighter friendships come to an end. It, does it affect the fight in any way, especially this late in their career? Or how do you view that? I have no idea what happened. I mean, I, I was as shocked as anybody else when I heard that he was leaving Robert, who I thought he was bound to at the hip, and having his, his father train him. I mean, I don't know what that's about. I haven't had an opportunity to talk to him.